Trends in Health Informatics, presented by Tanya S. Graham, for orientation to graduate studies at UMUC, Professor Julie Harding, January 28, 2017. The objective of this presentation is to define the healthcare informatics profession, identify trends in health informatics, and how they affect health informatics professionals, understand the relationship between health informatic trends in the U.S. health system. Healthcare informatics is defined as a systematic application of information management and technology to the planning and delivery of high quality and cost effective healthcare. Roles of the healthcare informatic professionals are to analyze data to determine healthcare decisions and actions improve patient outcome and satisfaction through data collection, ensure that patient's health information is integrated, accessible, and secure. Three trends that I will be addressing in this presentation are patient-generated health data, performance measurements, and care coordination tools. Patient-generated health data are data-related, are health-related data centered, recorded, or gathered by patient-generated health data are health-related data created, recorded, or gathered by or from patients. Home blood pressure monitors, glucometers, and even mobile medical applications such as a live core are examples of devices that patients can use to generate health data. Patient-generated health data on U.S. health system. Patient-generated health data has been proven to decrease healthcare expenditures. Decreasing the need of emergency intervention in chronic conditions by allowing patients to constantly monitor their condition and supply that data to the physician where the physician can intervene early before medical emergency intervention is necessary. Patient-generated health data in healthcare informatics. The healthcare informatics professionals are challenged with patient-generated health data in finding ways that the data can be shared privately and securely. Also, deciding how patient-generated health data should be incorporated in medical health records or it's also a challenge to ensure that patient-generated health data is not confused with physician's data. Determine the accuracy and validity of patient-generated health data is another challenge that the healthcare informatics professional face because many of the medical mobile applications are not FDA approved or FDA tested. Performance measures is another trend in health informatics. Performance measures are the regular collection of data to assess whether the correct processes are being performed and desired results are being achieved. Performance measures effects on the U.S. health system. The Center for Medicare and Medicaid Services uses performance measures in determining recommended care standards. The CMS website Hospital Compare ranks hospitals based on how well they are meeting the recommended care standards on performance measures. Improved performance measures has been proven to decrease U.S. health expenditures by improving patient satisfaction, improving patient retention, and decreasing duplicate testing when by patients changing providers. Performance measures in health informatics. The healthcare informatic professional is challenged on how to collect performance measurements data. Many of the data on performance measures can be found in the patient's social media accounts. So the healthcare informatic professional is challenged on finding methods in which to connect with patients through social media. 
collecting the data on those patient social media sites, analyzing the data that is collected, then formulating a plan based on that data on how to improve performance measurements. Care coordination is another trend in healthcare informatics. Care coordination bridges the gap, the healthcare information gap, between healthcare providers and between one healthcare facility and the next. Currently in the US, patient medical records are being transmitted on paper via fax or through the mail. Studies have shown that only 43% Care coordination. Care coordination bridges the healthcare information gap between all members of the healthcare team, improving communication between pro providers and between facilities. Currently, healthcare information are sent between providers or hospitals via fax or through the mail and are often incomplete. Incomplete medical records can result in duplicate testing and delay in care, which can result in increased medical expenditures. Care coordination in U.S. health system. The U.S. health system department has care coordination in U.S. health system. The health information exchange policy requires all healthcare providers to exchange health information electronically in its entirety starting in 2017. Care coordination can reduce duplicate testing. It can also reduce the delay in treatment, which can improve prognosis and decrease medical expenditures. Care coordination in health informatics. The health informatics professionals are faced with the challenge of developing a standardized electronic system for transmitting and receiving medical records. Currently in the US, each hospital system can have its own electronic medical record system, which may not be compatible with sharing. So standardizing will improve communication between um, one facility to the next. Analyzing electronic medical records and incorporating the data um, into the new provider system for treatment. Conclusion. The three trends in healthcare informatics aim to decrease healthcare expenditure, improve communication, between providers and improve communication between patients and their providers, improve efficiency and effectiveness in healthcare. Trends in healthcare informatics are heavily, heavily influenced by technology as well as government legislation. So staying on the breaking edge of technology and staying up to date with government legislation will, will keep you in the breaking edge of the healthcare informatics profession.